Hey loves, welcome back to another video. So today's intro was a little bit different because I was filming on my phone and then my phone just kept dying and it was saying that I had no um, space left so I have to use my boyfriend's phone and here I am. This is after we went to dinner so my makeup's already a little bit worn off and I'm super tired and sick, I'm so sorry but I'm trying my best for you guys. Um, my camera also broke, so this is why I have to do this. So anyways, um, today you guys will be learning how to do this look right here. I love how it came out. I used the Jaclyn Hill, Jaclyn Hill Times Morphe palette. And um, yeah, I hope you guys love this look. Um, let's jump right into it. Okay, so as always, we're going to start off by using my MAC, my MAC Fix Plus on my whole face to prime. Next off, we're going to be using my Maybelline Age Rewind Dark Circle Remover. And I always use this because it um, it really helps with under eye and it just helps to brighten up the under eye area. So you just look really clean and I feel like it's a really important step. So we're going to go ahead. Oh, and by the way, I'm going to be mixing this. And on the top, I'm going to be mixing the... Um, Maybelline Fit Me Concealer just to brighten it up a little bit extra. It gives it a smoother look. But for now, we're going to go ahead with the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. And I'm just going to be priming my lids. Meanwhile, I decide what I'm going to do with my my Jaclyn Hill um, Thames Murphy palette for sure because I want to play with that palette um, a little bit more. I haven't really gotten to play with it that much. So the palette comes with a little card with all the names of the shadows on them and if you do not have the palette then online there's the name of each color on each row just so you guys know. So I'm gonna do I'm gonna name the names rather than put my palette palette up all the time like for every color okay so first i'm gonna be starting off with the with the shade silk cream and met for each other they're right next to each other um the third and fourth color on the first row now the next color i'm going to be using is called butter and I'm gonna be applying, the, I'm sorry, not butter, pooter. And I'm gonna be applying that on my crease as well in windshield wiper motions. Okay, so now to darken up the crease a little bit, I'm going to be using the shade um, Mocha and chip a little uh, and I'm gonna kind of blend them together to darken up the crease because I'm gonna be doing a dark crease because I want to pop a blue I'm gonna play with the blues because they're just so pretty and I need to play with them like ASAP so yeah I'm gonna be doing that so we're gonna go ahead with the shade twerk and we're gonna try it on the lid and I'm gonna first use it without um fix plus on the brush to see how pigmented it is and then if it's not as pigmented I will add some fix plus so pigmented wow so then yep we're just gonna go ahead and start with that shade start wetting my brush with fix with some fix plus just to get that more pigmented look okay guys so I finished with the eyes and now okay so before I get into anything the lashes I use are these kiss lash couture foam ink collection um, in the style oh midnight this is where they were and right here, midnight. So that's the style, really cheap affordable lashes. They're like $7 and they're so pretty. Walgreens, by the way, 
Okay, so now we're gonna go ahead with um, foundation. Marc Jacobs Remarkable in the shade Beige Light. And we're gonna be mixing that with Dream Cushion from Maybelline in shade 40. Guys, I'm so sorry. I completely, the footage of me contouring, um, it cut off like it literally just got deleted from my phone because I am taking this video on my phone because I don't know what's wrong with my camera and I guess like the video just cut off and I kept doing my makeup and I didn't know I didn't hear anything so yeah whatever sorry for that guys and I just used this elf um, dual palette in the shade st. Lucia to contour everything and that's all I've done oh and then mascara I just used the their real their real lashes from the for the top and yep that's it so now we're gonna do highlighter just to finish off this look I'm gonna be using my Anastasia glow kit palette and we're gonna be using the shade um, bubbly and dripping in gold I'm gonna use fix plus thank you guys so much for watching I hope you guys love this today's look and this is what I accomplished so um yeah if you guys have any video suggestions please leave them down below and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do so and just give this video a thumbs up and comment down below I love you guys